What have you found there? <laughs> this was growing out of our compost. It looks like I might just put it in some soil and recover a whole cabbage later. You're gonna try and grow it? Yeah, I think so. Hey friends, um, so it's freezing today and here in Texas and we're gonna be making something vegan and nutritious for lunch. I've got some vegan meatballs here, black beans, a little bit of pepper, and a sweet potato that I bought at a farmer's market, and some onion and garlic. And I'm just gonna bake it in this baking dish. This is part of the Pioneer Woman collection. So David is chopping up the sweet potato into like cubes. Oh, maybe larger. You're making sticks. J okay, just do sticks. Oh, you want don't sticks? don't do cubes because yeah. I think you've cut them kind of small. Okay. And we've got some red onion, a little bit of pepper, and garlic chopped up. So now I'm just gonna go in with my chopped ingredients and just kind of um, mix them up a little bit. Don't forget the black beans. These are frozen. And then and then we've got our vegan meatballs. Can you them up? Yep. Okay. And then we're gonna hit it with a little bit of um pepper and red pepper flakes. I should probably put some salt. A little bit of kosher salt. Um, no, I guess I'm going to skip the oil this time and just put some uh, tomato sauce on top. And then I guess I'm going to put this into a preheat up even preheated oven at 375. I'm going to use my toaster oven. So I've got the oven preheated at 375 and this is just going to go in for um, I think about 45 minutes and then I'll check on it. So you got a nice little planter there. Yes, this is so we can water it inside. Hopefully it'll have enough sun and nutrients to grow. It's done. I added five minutes of the cooking time. And Lynn's just heating up some rice. Okay, do you want to serve yourself some? Oh, sure. Do I serve you guys first? Thank you. Sure. And so how did you make this rice, Lynn? leftover rice that I made in the rice cooker and I like rice with flavor so I added paprika, Italian herbs and seasonings and some mm. uh, salt and pepper. Mm. It looks really good and fragrant. Yeah. Or you want me to add rice right if I give it to you too much? Oh, oh that's, that's enough. That looks great. Yeah just one meatball for me. Delicious. Great job, boys. Okay. Thank you. I'll have two scoops, please. <laughs> Thank you. This is really pretty. Yeah. I have one scoop. Potato is sweet. It took a long time to cook. Mm -hmm. mm. The meatballs are good. Mm. They taste all very meaty. <laughs> but there's no meat in these. <laughs> yeah. It's fun. It's kind of like a everything substituted ratatouille. 
<laughs> okay, let's try this. I like it. Um, the meatball and sauce is just a classic combination. Um, the potatoes are kind of very, a little rigid, but they kind of just taste like carrots. The rice is really good. I would give it probably a 7 out of 10.